Blessed is the one who does not walk in step with the wicked, or stand in the way that sinners take, or sit in the company of mockers, but whose delight is in the law of the Lord, who meditates on his law day and night. Oh, that person is like a tree planted by streams of water, which yield its fruit in season, whose leaf does not wither, whatever they do prospers. You see, the psalmist is going to give us the first psalm in really two parts. So remember, Psalm 1 is really two. It's two different contrasts. Contrasts of a wise life and contrasts of a foolish, or the word that he would use, would be a wicked life. So basically, Psalm 1 is, here's what to do and here's what not to do. Check out the new series on praiseandharmony.tv called Come to the Table by Dr. John Mark Hicks. The gospel invites all to the table. The gospel doesn't make a division between rich and poor, slave and free, male and female, black and white, Jew and Gentile. The gospel doesn't make those kind of divisions. The gospel unites at the table, and the table is the experience of communion between the rich and the poor, between the Jew and the Gentile, between the male and the female. In this eight-part study, you'll grow from in-depth lessons about communion. This series comes with PDF study guides and materials for small group leaders or families to use to help facilitate a more meaningful time of learning. I like the way Luther put it. When I am afflicted and a Satan is assaulting me, I don't run away from the table. I run to the table. Because this is a table of mercy. See, God is doing something at this table. I know we don't typically think about it that way. We tend to think about, what am I doing? I'm remembering, I'm proclaiming, I'm eating. But we need to think about what God is doing at this table. Come to the Table, available now at praiseandharmony.tv.